Hello everyone, welcome back to the channel. Today we're going to have a short video briefly comparing GetResponse versus MailChimp. Before we start, I'd like to briefly mention that there is a link to a free trial of GetResponse in the description below. So if you just scroll down to the description and click that link, it'll take you to a completely free trial of GetResponse for you to try out. With that said, let's get on with the video. GetResponse and MailChimp are two popular email marketing and automation platforms that offer a range of similar features. However, there are some differences between the two that may make one a better fit for your business needs than the other. Number one, features. While both platforms offer email automation, landing pages, and list management, GetResponse offers more advanced features such as webinars, e-commerce tools, and advanced segmentation. MailChimp, on the other hand, offers more integrations with third-party platforms, such as social media and e-commerce platforms. Number two, pricing. GetResponse offers more affordable pricing plans for businesses with smaller email lists, while MailChimp's pricing can be more cost-effective for larger lists. Both platforms offer a tri uh, free trial period, with GetResponse offering a longer 30-day trial compared to MailChimp's 14-day trial. Number three, user interface. MailChimp offers a more modern and intuitive user interface compared to GetResponse, which can be more text heavy and complex. MailChimp also offers more customizable templates for email campaigns. Number four, customer support. Both platforms offer reliable customer support with GetResponse offering 24 seven live chat and phone support, while MailChimp offers email and chat support during business hours. So in conclusion, while both GetResponse and MailChimp are powerful email marketing automation platforms, the choice between them depends on your business needs and priorities. GetResponse may be a better option for businesses looking for advanced features and affordability, while MailChimp may be a better choice for businesses looking for a more modern and customizable user interface and integrations with third-party platforms. So that's my brief comparison of GetResponse versus MailChimp. I hope you liked the video. If you did, feel free to give the video a like and give the channel a subscribe to see more videos like this. Also, if you have any questions or suggestions, you can leave them in the comment section below. And before I end this video, I would like to briefly mention that there's a link in the description below for a software that can rank your website instantly by using videos. This might be interesting to anyone looking for more traffic and sales to their website. So make sure to check it out if this is something that you might need. Uh, but yeah, thanks for watching and I hope to see you in the next video.